Grizzlies hosting the Bucks, and the Bucks are 10 point favorites. The over under is at 225 and a half. The Bucks are minus 550 on the money line, and the Grizzlies are plus 410. Now, these are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to tip off tomorrow. I believe the Grizzlies played tonight. They did, and they actually beat the Rockets 121 113. The Bucks didn't play after being embarrassed the other night, so we'll see how rested they are for this game. As far as the lineups are concerned for tomorrow's game, that means that the Grizzlies probably won't have one, but the Bucks will. Lillard, Beasley, Crowder, Giannis, and Lopez. Lillard is listed as probable. Ankle injury, Giannis, knee patella tendonitis. And like I said, Grizzlies don't have a lineup as of yet. Now, they have not played each other yet this season. The Grizzlies are on a three-game winning streak against the Bucks. They are 6-4 and four against them in their last 10. The road team is 6-4. and four. The favorite has won and covered the last two games they've played against each other. The favorite is 6-4 and four against the spread. The favorite is 7-3 and three on the money line. The over is hitting their last two. The over is 6-4, and four, and the over at 225.5 is 7-3. and three. The Bucks are 4 and 6 in their last 10, 4 and 6 against the spread, and the under is 8 and 2. They are 2 and 2 in their last 4. The two games that they won, they covered. The under is hitting their last 3. 234, 204, then 100 uh 207 points and then 220 points. They lost by 24 to the T-Wolves, then they lost by uh, they won by 36 against the Hornets. Then they beat the Nuggets by 17 and then got washed by 26 by the Heat. And that game wasn't even nearly that close. The Grizzlies are 1-9 in their last 10, 6-4 against the spread, and the over-under is 5-5. Five five. They've covered their last two. There was a total of 228, 221, then 183, and then 234. They lost by 8 to the Bulls, by 9 to the Hornets, then they lost by nine again to the Pelicans, and then they beat the Rockets tonight by eight. This is just a damned if you do and damned if you don't. If the Bucks come out and play the way that they're supposed to, the Grizzlies should not even be on the same court as them. I'm going to take a shot and just say that. Bucks with the money line, Bucks laying the points and the over, and if the Bucks don't cover this damn game, you may not want to bet the Bucks the rest of the year. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.